This is a Sterling engine that you assemble yourself. It's a kit, so to speak, and it is sold by Engine DIY. Engine DIY reached out to me. and They asked if I'd be interested in one of their kits. And as you all know, I love Sterling engines. So I asked them if they would send this to me and they did. Inside the box, you will find all the parts and pieces to assemble and operate this little engine. The first thing I like to do is get all of the parts laid out in front of me so I can very quickly find them. I try to organize them a little bit. So I think the best way to do one of these videos is to very quickly assemble it on camera and then at the end we'll make it run and we'll talk about it here we go So now that this generator is configured, let's go ahead and start it and see how well it operates. It's had to flame on it for maybe a good minute. Let's go ahead and kickstart it and see if it runs. And there it goes. And you can see on the back of the generator is an LED. So that tells us we are generating electricity. We also have a voltmeter. You might not be able to see this in the camera, but it is generating 2.65 volts, now 2.7. It'll probably go up the hotter this gets and then things start running a little more efficiently. And there is an LED light that is on a USB port. And when we plug that in, we do get light. So things are working the way they should work. I really like the Sterling generator. So what are my final thoughts? Well, I really like this kit. I really think it would be a great kit to teach somebody, maybe a younger person, about some mechanics. It will also teach them a little bit about electricity as well. And it's just a fun kit to assemble. It's great hands-on experience. I also think the hobbies would enjoy something like this. And if you're a fan of Sterling engines like I am, well, every time I fire up one of these little engines, I'm always amazed. There is something about running an engine and generating electricity off nothing but heat that, well, it just brings a smile to my face. If you like these types of videos, don't forget to like and subscribe. Take a look at some of my other videos. At the very least, you might be entertained.